Hello everyone, it's Laura Myers for Steam is Connected. With design and content being such large areas of interest for me, I always love to have the conversation of not only how they interact with each other, but also how the creatives in this realm can push the boundaries and not be shackled by the coding side of things. For this reason, I'm really excited to speak with John Moore Williams, Head of Content Strategy at Webflow a platform aiming to empower editors, designers, and developers alike in creating unique and dynamic websites. Hello, John. How are you doing today? I'm doing very well. How are you, Laura? I'm fantastic. Thank you. I'm really interested to hear what are the most unique features of Webflow? Okay. Um, so the first and foremost uh, unique aspect of uh, Webflow is the fact that it um, was designed and built to give uh, designers a visual way to produce production-ready code. Um, so this has been sort of a missing piece in the web design industry for a long time now, and there have been many attempts to fill, fill the gap. Um, we think we're doing a really good job of it um, due to the code quality that we're able to produce. Um, and the fact that it's not template-based the way that most of the similar solutions um, are. You can start from a completely blank canvas and design whatever um, you envision. Um, you can even make mistakes if you want. We try to guide you in the right direction, but uh, we, give, we give our users a lot of freedom. So, yeah. I like that. Content to design can sometimes be like a chicken or the egg situation. How does the designer element of the platform work with content? Um, so the, um, the CMS and the designer tool um, are very, very closely integrated. So essentially how it works is you create the structure for your content um, in the, the CMS um, and then input some content. We, can, we let you generate um, fake content or dummy content rather um, if you'd like, if you don't have real content to work with, though we definitely encourage like working with the real content so you get a more empathetic viewpoint of what will be done with your CMS. Um, and then once that's created, you can go onto any page of um, your site in the designer and pull in what we call a dynamic list. And that's basically um, a framework for referencing the elements of your content. So you can then pull in any component um, that is part of the collection that you created in the CMS. And so heading, image, text, whatever, and then just tell it to connect to the database and it automatically pulls that content in. Um, so you instantly see how uh, your headline lengths work with your design, uh, you know, all of those other elements, you can instantly see what the content in your database will look like on the display end. And in speaking of content, how does it empower the content creators? Um, I think it does that in several ways. So um, on one hand, it gives them the ability to create highly structured content that fits exactly whatever their goal is or the best way to model the content at hand. Um, so you can, uh, the content creator can create the database structure, and this is something I do regularly with the designers um, within the tool. And then you just hand, you don't even hand that off; it's just there, available for them and the designer whenever they're ready for it. Um, so I, that's hugely empowering. I mean, I used to hand off spreadsheets and graphs that I made in Sketch, you know, to like represent the content model. But rather than handing off a representation, I'm handing the real thing. Um, so that's very empowering on the creation end. And then um, we also, on the front end of the site, you literally, to log into the CMS, instead of like going into a dashboard that's like behind the scenes, um, you can log into basically what still looks like your website, and you can edit all that content right there on the page. Um, so you can see exactly how it's going to look for the end user. Uh, and then also, um, because you create sort of a unique database for every site, um, the elements that are in the dashboard are exactly what your database does. It's not some generic stock thing. You don't have the same links that everybody else does. It's perfectly crafted around your site. Um, so there's, there's nothing useless there for you. Really sounds like at the heart of it, everything is just much more streamlined and accessible, which I am sure is appreciated. Now, content strategy is gaining so much traction right now in the marketing world. So how does Webflow? 
help to enhance strategy within organizations? Um, okay, so big question. Um, <laughs> So I come from um, a content strategy background that's more on the uh, product design end. Um, I've worked in copywriting, SEO, product design, UX writing. Um, so I think of content strategy as this very, very big thing um, that just like content marketing is just one area of that. Uh, so I think it empowers content strategists who are doing a wide variety of that work. But on the content marketing side in particular, I think the fact that you're able to structure the database around your content instead of trying to shoehorn it into like everything is a blog post and that's, you know, or your developer that in some custom code that is like kind of weird to work with. Um, it's all native and they're structured around your content. Um, so I think that gives content strategists a lot more control and helps them ensure that the content and the in to a certain extent the design itself accurately represents the strategy behind um, what's driving the particular content types that you're developing. I think that's what interests me the most about this platform, how it allows for the design and content to work together in a way where they can almost inspire each other rather than be at odds of which comes first. Well, that's all the questions I have for you, John. Thank you so much for your time today. Yeah, no problem. My pleasure. Mine too. That was John Moore Williams, head of content strategy at Webflow, discussing how their platform is bringing together the elements of design, content, and coding into one streamlined and easy to use system. For all the latest on various platforms in the wide world of digital business, visit us often here at Seamless Connected.